There we go, boom. Yes, in, baby. All right, there we go. Oh, he's a little dude. Little dude on a big old bait. <laughs> Look at that, boom. Whoo, blank is done, baby. Man. Okay. I was gonna go somewhere else, but I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know. So, I've been using the patch. I have found a fish. I'm now gonna switch over to the fishes. Oh. All right, I've probably played that spot out a little bit, but if you're at a spot for an hour, two hours, and nothing's happening, man. Move, go somewhere else. Go, just so what? You're out here. Hold on, I'm getting stuck in the mud. Whoa. Let me find a solid bit. Oof. Ooh, that's not a solid bit. So, I'm just gonna stop right here for a second. So yeah, go to another spot, man. You're out here anyway, might as well. Go and find the fish, cause the fish ain't gonna come and find you, man. Wow. We're off finding fish again. I think low is at 10 to seven, I think. And it's just gonna be seven o'clock right now. So I'm going down here. Off finding the fish again, man. Like I said, they're not gonna come and find you. So we gotta go and find them. This spot I'm at, I fished it last year. It's been good on the flood, which it is at the moment. Depending on marks or spots, whatever you wanna call them, each one fish is different. And it's about putting in the footwork and seeing which one fishes at what tide, what time of day, what color lure, but pretty basically, the saltwater angler put up a post yesterday. If you're just starting out, man, don't worry about colors yet. You don't need to do that yet. Is it important? I think so. But you don't you don't need that stuff yet, man. So, like he said, what you need in your box? Oh, I'm out of breath, man. What you need in your box is a surface lure, a deep diver shallow diver and a few soft plastic that's all you need to start off with man worry about color and all that stuff after you've got your watercraft and all that business set in stone you want to learn your marks high low first light last light middle of the day each spot is different and once you get that going then then you can start on your colors you don't need it, man. Just get out, go fish, and learn your spots. There's been a lot of questions lately about what do I use when I go out? I've been out a couple of times and I don't seem to be getting anything. Here's a little bit of encouragement. Not every day is a catching day, but Every day is a school day, man. Every time you go out, you learn something. Every single time. Every single time. Remember, when you're reflecting on your sessions, remember what you did to get that one fish. Remember what you did to get that one rise. Remember what you did to tie your line up. And don't do it, don't do it again. I do it all the time, man. It happens. We don't always catch but we always learn something and we always love being out here, man. I think there was a reason I ain't been out here before. Now I remember there's no solidness here at all. 
none. And that kind of stuff right there is what I mean, man. So I've just learned, or now I remember, that I haven't come all the way down here on the low tide because it's knee deep in mud, man. Yeah, but that's the only kind of stuff that you can figure out if you get out there, man. So get out there and try stuff out. I'm gonna look for this kind of stuff because is there gonna be fish here? Hmm, maybe at high tide, but it empties out. It empties out into the bigger, into the bigger sea thing. So there's actually some flow there. There's some movement. Bass like that, fish like that, fish like current, fish like movement. All this stuff here, all this, all this weed. Remember, I'm down here on a low tide. On a high tide, this is all covered. Brilliant, brilliant feeding ground, man. One for luck right behind me because sometimes they're behind you but not today it just goes to show man every day is not a catching day so hopefully that's a little bit of encouragement for you guys just starting out. I've come out this morning, I've been out since three. I've had thousand casts and I've had one fish. It happens, man, that's why it's called fishing. If you went out every time and you caught every time, it might, it might end up getting boring for you, man. Go out, learn some stuff. If things are getting slow, you see the sun come up too high, don't always go by that. I go by that because those are my marks. My marks, or my spots, fish best at first light. There are some that fish best in the middle of the day. You just gotta try it out. Get down to your local harbor or seafront or wherever you're gonna go and try it out. Try it out at different states of the tide, different times a day, neap tides, spring tides, low tides, high tides, first light, middle of the day, lunch time, last light. Unless you get out there and try, man, you're not going to know. So, all right, I'm off. That's me, guys. I hope this has given you a little bit of encouragement to get out. If you've been out three times and you haven't caught, you've only been out three times and you haven't caught. You'll go out and you'll catch again. I promise you but you gotta keep trying, man. Do not give up. Number one tip, do not give up.